Whoa, Vivek! Oh, hey man, how are you? Vivek Ramaswamy, good to meet you. Hey. Uh, listen, wh wh who's your friend here? I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. No, I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. I'm, well, maybe, maybe, what? maybe there can be two. No, no, there can't be two. I'm Vivek Ramaswamy, and this is my story. Vivek, how you doing? Hey man, Vivek Ramaswamy, it's so good to be here with you. Listen, I have something very important to tell you. There is an impersonator who is pretending to be me. He's been crashing my events, he's been doing interviews, and, and we're gonna stop that. We speak truth to tyranny. We're gonna go find this guy. Are, are you free this week? Uh, I have to check. That, that's fine, don't, don't even worry about it. I'll, I'll just take you with me. You don't really have a choice. <laughs> uh, oh, hey man, it's me. Vivek Ramaswamy, good to meet you. Hey, what's up? Are you coming along to Iowa on uh, the train? I, I think so. Oh, okay, amazing. So then we got in this thing called an Uber and we went all the way to the airport. We had a very interesting conversation in there. Kanye? Did you actually vote for Kanye? That's fantastic. Uh, what do you like about Kanye? Yeah, what do you like about Kanye? He's an amazingly genius musician. Love that. And and that's all you really need. When you're that talented, you can... That's what I mean, because Kanye is also bipolar and crazy. But I'm saying, mm. what if you put like someone like Nas? Right. But you voted for Kanye, though. Yeah, I voted for Kanye because he was at least the best of those alternatives. Right. So on that note, we were at the airport. Oh, hey, man. How are you? Vivek Ramaswamy. Dude, we came here together. Now, now that you're here, um... Do you mind if I have a little bit of your time? So, so we're actually gonna fly American Airlines today. Um, we have a lot of language options here. We're gonna pick um, English. And right now I'm pulling it up on my iPhone. Great American product, the iPhone. Aren't those made in China? Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> I went to Harvard, I went to Yale, I think I would know. So it's really important in this country that we have security, right? Right now we have some great security here. We need borders, and I spent a lot of time at Borders Bookstore. That's how I went to Harvard, that's how I went to Yale. <laughs> Stay tuned for more. Point out something really interesting. So, so we have someone walking here, and, and he seems to have a uh, uh, some sort of a lightsaber. I think he might be a uh, Star Wars fan. Uh, personally, I believe the third one is the best Revenge of the Sith, but... Uh, I'm not quite sure what he's doing, but, but see, we have a separation in this country, and, and, and that's really a problem. We need to talk to everyday Americans, so I think I'm gonna try to go, are we able to talk to him, or? I don't think so. Okay, that's fine, then. That's the deep state right now. You feel that energy? We're gonna speak truth to tyranny. We will not get conquered by the deep state. We will fly over it. <laughs> and as the plane took off, we met a man who had an interesting device. Hey, it's me, Vivek Ramaswamy. We're here with this uh, gentleman. What's your name? Uh, Grande All. Grande All. Look at the look at what what do you call this de device? I've never seen this, this thing is, before. Flip phone. Oh, this is fantastic. We learned so much in this country, <laughs> and uh, something very crazy happened actually. What happened? We got delayed. How how close were we making this? Uh, I don't know, it's, it's cutting it really close. How long have we been on here? I feel like six hours. <laughs> we did this in two last minutes. Like, did you even book the hotel? We, we no, didn't even I thought you did. Uh, this is so bad. <laughs> supposed to stop over in this place called Phoenix just for an hour or two but they had to spend the night so uh, well you know how that went we got the scrub mommy here <laughs> and uh, I do like mommy I am a mama's boy and uh, you gotta scrub it you think so Oh, I'm ready. You guys ready to make this? We are. We're ready. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. You better go back home. We're here for the coffee. We're doing viral. Good to see you. Good morning. 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 Good so finally, we had arrived in Iowa. <laughs> Welcome to Des Moines. A great success! You snuck in. That was hilarious. <laughs> Welcome to Iowa. Holy... Oh my god. 
we're gonna go find out where this impersonator is and uh, we're gonna speak truth to him and put some sense into him. Stay tuned, it's, it's cold out here, but I don't know, might, might be adrenaline. I don't think it's that bad, but we'll find out. Stay tuned. So everyone told us do not drive. You know, there's a lot of white stuff on the road. Iowa, I'm about to crush it. So take me home, Iowa. Hey, Vivek. Oh, what hey, man, how are you? What are you doing? Well, listen, uh, one of the things is when you're driving around in the in, in, in this white stuff, as they call it, uh, you know, there's been a lot of edging and I think everything just blew. We gotta always clean it with a towel. Very, very important in this country. <laughs> well, wait, I, I don't think yeah. you're wearing the right shoes. Oh, uh, no, these are absolutely the right shoes. These are very nice, actually. I know the white stuff's getting on there, but that's okay. So then what happened is we got all the way to this event and there was a lot of white stuff. We were freezing, trying to walk all the way in there. And once we walked in there, uh, let's see what happens. Let's, uh, let's keep gonna, it going. This is gonna be crazy, man. Oh yeah, let's see, let's see how it goes. We're gonna, we're gonna figure this out. There was nobody there. So turns out we came to the wrong Wellman's pub. So we're gonna go. See, that's what the deep state does to us though. They try to send us to the wrong places. <laughs> but uh, we speak the truth that on a night like tonight, even though I don't smoke, <laughs> don't do drugs. Listen, I don't think I've ever been edged this long. Vivek is edging me a lot and I'm just ready to Ready to what? Just ready to exp Just ready to, wow, there's a lot of white stuff everywhere. God. So what did you do next? We decided to follow his website and we went to the next place on his list. <laughs> and then we caught him. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. Let's get in here. Let's get in here. We're gonna find out who this guy is. Look at this. We're gonna find out who this guy is. You see this? You found my impersonator. You found my impersonator. It's so good to meet you. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. We have an impersonator up there. We need to figure out what's going on. Come on. We need to figure out what's going on. What's going on? How are you? Awesome. How are you? Thank you. Look at this. We have our impersonator up there. We don't know what's going on. We don't know what's going on right now. But apparently my impersonator's up there on stage. I don't know what's going on. Let's find out. Tell us how it went. Well. That's it on photo. Oh, we gotta do one more. Huh? We gotta do one more photo. Yeah, he has it. Okay. Vivek. What's going on? Vivek, it's Vivek Ramaswamy. Good yeah, to meet you. I, I gotta tell you something. I'm Vivek, by the way. Vivek, nice to meet you. So nice to meet you. Listen, um, it's a very important day, January 15th. It is. It's okay. So important. It's, it's so the important. most important time in this country. It is. It's the 75th Annual Emmy Awards. Oh, is that right? We need to vote for Quinta Brunson. We're going to replace the Department of Education with Abbott Elementary. Oh, really? Yeah, it's going to be huge. You're operating on a different plane. Yeah, God bless America and God bless Hollywood. How did you become so brilliant? Uh, listen, I, I, I just think that, Where'd you know, you when I was young, Harvard, Yale, yeah. multi-billion dollar companies. Got it, got it. Yeah. The, the and a leader of a different where did you generation. Like the Golden Globes? Uh, I loved it. You did? I yeah. thought it was great. That's good. I thought That's it was cool. great. Thank Listen. You for, thank you for being here. Of course. Thank you for uh, for, for, for doing this impersonation. I think I think you're doing a good job. And, I, and <laughs> I'll and i tell you what. The impersonation. Uh, yeah. Well, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. But but keep doing your thing. Right, I'm proud of you. And I, and I have a feeling uh, you're going to be in this for a long time. Thank you. And I think <laughs> I'm going to be seeing you I again. Appreciate okay? That. I appreciate that. Okay. Might, maybe okay. with a little less hair than you have. But. Maybe, well, no, no. I think you're doing great. Let's take a let's take a picture. The impersonation remains a good one. Well, he's the impersonator. <laughs> that's funny. I just got that. <laughs> Took me like two seconds to get that. So we had finally done it. We had to clap it up. We told the impersonator, stop coming to our events. And then it was media time. Oh yeah. Here's my interview in front of all the people in the media. That's me, Vivek Ramaswamy on the $1 bill. <laughs> So it's me, Vivek Ramaswamy, but uh, I'm here with Vivek's dad, actually, and he wants me to do some different impressions. So, hey, it's me, Rami. Rami Malik. I won an Oscar for Bohemian Rhapsody. It's a great movie about Queen. Do you know Freddie Mercury? How was that? <laughs> was that good? <laughs>
cool. And then the craziest thing happens. So you see this guy in the green jacket, right? So he seems like he's just a fan of me, right? And then his friend here in the black jacket, they both wanted pictures and I didn't think anything of it until I saw this happen at the Fake Vivek's rally. They had staged a protest to let him know that he was a liar, perhaps because he was the impersonator. Anyway, back to the movie. Meeting more fans, meeting more fans. <laughs> Yo, I love your TikTok. And then it was back to the campaign trail. How are you good? Wait, where'd you go? <laughs> gonna stop believing until we win in this country. <laughs> So right after that, I had an interview with Brett Baer of Fox News. You know, Fox News, one of the most unbiased sources. And so we wanted to go there and have that good conversation. But when we showed up, this happened. Looks like we're a little late, but that's okay. There are a lot of people um, in there. There are a lot of people here. I think it's going to be very interesting. <laughs> got a great guy over here. What a great guy. Good to see you. Once again, the impersonator jumped into my interview and this happened. Vivek, I really like you. <laughs> But it'd be huge if you stepped aside. I would say what's going to be huge is when I step up. But alas, the real Vivek was there watching. And don't worry, we took care of it. So I decided to go to Brett Bear afterwards and I said, Brett, you know you didn't interview the real Vivek Ramaswamy. <laughs> Hey, Brett. Hey, Vivek. Yeah, good to see it's you. Good to meet you. We speak truth to tyranny. I thought you did a great job in the interview. The impression for Trump could, could work a little bit. A little bit. Work on but it was good, though. Yeah. Was good I like this. You know, this is a good... We're, we're doing what we need to do. We're out here on the campaign trail. You know, we're dressed for it, right? Yeah. The snow's not going to stop us. Have you, people come up to you and ask you questions? All the time. All the time. All the time. And yeah. we always have the right answers. That's right. So we have one thing. Thank you very much. So, reverse racism. Is ready, ready to come to but is vegan chicken chicken? That's a good question. Yeah, what's your answer? I say it's chicken. You think it's chicken? Yeah. Okay, that's great. <laughs> so anyway, we had to see where the impersonator went next. This guy had created his own campaign headquarters. What he was headquartering, I wasn't sure. But when we showed up there, he wasn't around. So what did we decide to do? There are two genders, Iowans and Californians, yeah. but Iowans are cooler. Woo! Way cooler. No, it's actually been freezing out here. I don't know how you guys do it. I really don't know how you guys do it. It's really something else. But um, I appreciate all the support. There's been an impersonator that's been crashing all of my events. Um, I finally handled that situation, so we're going to keep it going. When you have a difference of opinion with someone, you need to face them face them head on, and face this impersonator. We did. Whoa, Vivek! Oh, hey man, how are you? Vivek Ramaswamy, good to meet you. Hey. Uh, listen, wh wh who's your friend here? I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. No, I'm Vivek Ramaswamy. I'm, well, maybe, 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 maybe it, there can be two. No, no, there can't be two. There listen, can't be two? listen, so. That, that, that well, doesn't work. No, no, the... it doesn't work. Well, now that I have you, now that I have you, Headspace, um, for yeah. a quick second, um, it's nice that you choose to identify as me, <laughs> but you can't just choose to do that, right? Well, um, I say there are two genders, as you know. So maybe right, Iowans there are and Californians. Two so. Well, there's Iowans and Californians, oh, there's, there's two. but Iowans are cooler. I thought you said it was rich and poor. No, no, no it's Iowans oh, and okay, cooler, got it, got because it. it's very cold out here. We've been <laughs> freezing. But, but, having said that, now that I have you here, in order to vote in this country, you need to know something about the country. That's right. Right? It's Thomas Jefferson. Hmm. Right? Do you, are you familiar with him? I know. Oh, okay, cool. Because he has this thing called the swivel chair. Yes, so that's right. So anytime I get questions, I can just swivel. That's right? right. Very, very easy. He also said, we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal. Mm -hmm. Did you know that? I did know that. Okay, cool. He actually didn't say that. He said, we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now, now you understand that. Okay. One last question for you. All right. Who's on the $1 bill? And George Washington. Ah, it's, it's, it's actually not. It's, um, it's actually... Vivek Ramaswamy. <laughs> wait, no, no, no. Wait, that looks like you. No, no, no. That's not. That must be fake. Sorry, it's Vivek Ramaswamy. <laughs> okay, 
All right. Well, listen, now that you're here, I, I think I could probably, I could probably just give you this dollar. Oh, Wait. I like that. Wait, who? <laughs> Do you, there's another? Yeah, it's, it's uh, probably the best first lady we're going to ever have had. And that's uh, Porva Ramaswamy right there. Wow. I need to, I need to think about some things. <laughs> <laughs> so how'd it go? You know, it had me thinking. Maybe I wasn't the real Vivek Ramaswamy. Maybe he was the real Vivek Ramaswamy. Maybe I was making this whole thing up in my head because I hadn't found my first lady. Nah, I'm Vivek Ramaswamy and I approve this message. <laughs>